Hey, welcome back to Dad Life Chess. This is Joel. It has been a while. Matter of fact, it's been quite a while. Took the entire month of December off recording. Tried to take a little break from serious chess of any kind whatsoever. Been playing a lot of Blitz. Yes, I know, but uh, enjoying it. You know, um, just enjoying uh, chess. Kind of had to reevaluate uh, the how much time I was spending with serious study and. Um, yeah, look forward to making videos this year, hopefully on a regular basis back to it. But uh, who knows, we may not get the same um, amount of games, but we're, maybe our rating will go up and down. Who knows? Who knows? But uh, trying to try to remind myself that chess is a game and uh, it's enjoyable to play. And that's basically what we got. I don't know what I'm doing in this game at all, but we are doing it. I think I've played this opponent before. Um, yeah, we've played, wow, we played um, five times. And uh, my opponent has, I think, uh, I have a winning record against this opponent, but that does not mean anything. Don't want to do that. Um, let's just bring this guy in. Here, here. Just go here. I don't like these kind of things. Yeah, let's go. Let's go here. Thinking about castle and queen side. I just got that kind of feeling right now. But hey, yeah, hope you had a wonderful new year and uh, Merry Christmas, all those things. Uh, thank you for watching. If you haven't already, uh, please uh, subscribe. Uh, that helps out the channel. If you could uh, subscribe, click the like button, comment, you know the drill. Um, it's all greatly appreciated for sure. My opponent's going to say, hey, we're going to do something on the e-file, and you better beware. But two can play this game. Two can play this game because I can now bring my rook onto the e-file. And uh, we're going to be we're going to be saying who's who's better. <coughs> Who is better? I like my chances. I like my chances in this game. I gave up the bishop pair, perhaps prematurely. But, um, yeah, we have five games together, my opponent and I. I feel like um, we need to not allow the evening of the score. Who knows? Who knows what will happen? I think my opponent's name is Joel as well. Joel Scott. Good times. Good name, Joel. Okay, so do I just want to, like, go full h pawn mode let's do it let's just let's see what my opponent does see if we can get a any kind of concession they have this it's kind of annoying i have this check they can drop back Bishop here, I might even drop back here. Gotta be careful of these things. I've lost way too many games with the Bishop H6 tactic. Um, I'll never forget the first time I ever saw that tactic. I was playing over the board and early on, quite a few years ago, I was crushing my opponent and I really was just doing, like I thought I was just doing so well in the position. And then like out of nowhere, my opponent plays bishop h6, and uh, I was thinking, what in the world? And everything, everything fell apart after that. Um, so yeah. Okay, so I'm half inclined to go here. Just push h, h5. When you push h4, you gotta push h5, right? That's how, that's how it works, I think. So if my opponent goes here, 
that might be annoying because, yeah. Hmm. <laughs> oh, that's a check. Um. Go here. Check. Here. Here. Let's go here. I think this is the wrong. I think I'm playing a little too passively. I think I should keep my queen because uh, the only thing is, is basically this. Oh, really? Push. Ooh, I just thought of something. Now we can go here. It makes my life very difficult. Very difficult. Eggs. We're getting somewhere. We are getting somewhere. here and then here let's go here Hmm. Kind of just playing this by uh, um, instinct. And I think that's kind of my issue with playing a lot of Blitz over the holiday break is you kind of get into this instinctive way of playing. And I feel like my opponent is probably going to trap my bishop, <laughs> my, my rook. That's kind of the feeling I have. I often feel that in these kind of positions. Um, It's like in this situation, I have this. Um, I also have this, this. Check. I guess I had that right away. Did I have that right away? No, I don't think so. Because he has this. Takes here. Check. Huh. Here. I think I'm backing here. My opponent really doesn't want to do that, I don't think. Like, I have this. Check. Check. How do I go check? Ooh, this is interesting. Check. Here. Takes. And this is, this is falling. So, my opponent's got to do something. Go here. Huh. 
half inclined to play this. Here, here, okay. Hmm. I don't know where to put any of my pieces. That's the problem. I could attack here. I attack here. I go here, I go here. You ever play a game and you're like, I just need another piece to do something. And then you ask yourself, why would I exchange off my pieces? Um, okay, there's that. Takes, check, takes. Let's go here. Check. Text. Hmm. Okay. We are thinking. Maybe back here. Go down back here. Okay, let's go here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Here. I want to keep my bishop active, and I think attacking this pawn is going to be my best choice. Therefore, I don't want to fall for anything. Am I falling for anything? Part of me says maybe. I have this. Um... If 
I was, if he was forced to take, let's go here. Here. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go here. Ooh, I'm going to go here and here, actually. Hmm. Kind of an intense game. Um, check. Check. Okay. He says there's something about this. Check. He goes here. I go... Oh, wow. Check this out. Check. He goes here. Takes, takes, takes here. That is beautiful. That is beautiful. That is pretty, yeah. That was pretty. That was pretty. Wow. Okay, that was a fun. That was a fun game. That was a fun game. Um, we're gonna look at the game review here. I, I think that tactic works, and uh, I'm hoping that Stockfish doesn't say horrible tactic. Um, no, I was hoping for a brilliant move. It's not a brilliant, uh, but it was definitely uh, definitely there. So we had we had a good advantage. We lost it, I think, through the ebbs and flow of the game. Uh, not a huge. Um, not a great, great game. I'm 75, 72% for my opponent and I. But um, all right, let's see. Let's kind of go through this. Um, yeah, that's probably not the best. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, taking taking with the um, taking with the knight is probably better. Here takes takes and then dropping back here. But uh, I don't know. I was just like, let's just let's take the. Uh, uh, let's take and give up the bishop here. Um, so this, let's see here. I'm going to take off this feedback, I think. Let's go here. Uh, I, I, I like the I like the graphical feedback here. Um, oops. Let's see here. Boom, boom, boom. Let's go through these. It takes, takes here, here. Okay. Yeah, I'm looking for like bigger swings than like, you know, half a pawn. Um, a lot of that doesn't matter it's too much at my level. Uh, wait a second. H4 is the second best move here. Harry, Harry the H fun. Matter of fact, it's actually it, Rook H E A. Rook H E1 is H4 is the number one move according to Stockfish. It fine. Stockfish, Stockfish knows what is up. It took Stockfish um, a little bit of time, but yeah, H4, X Glam. We're going to give that an X Glam. Don't be taking away. Don't be taken away from uh, the glory of H4. All of this is good here. Queen C4 is the best. So this is actually good. Um, Ironically, I should just take here. This is not good. A A three A three is not good. A three allows Bishop E six. Yes, I was curious what would happen. Bishop E six. I'm kind of forced to play D five, and then Knight takes. Yikes! Yikes! C six. Ugh. That. Oops. Sorry. That. This is yucky. Bishop can take because this is nothing. This is nothing. Yeah, I definitely made a mistake. Uh, A3, bad move. Uh, thankfully, my opponent didn't see it. Missed an opportunity. Um, 
hg is okay queen takes is correct actually king okay um bishop c4 here bishop c4 is better i think why is that bishop c4 king here bishop d3 back here what if back here now it's saying knight d5 okay yeah on here um so my rook h7, not great. This uh, bishop c4 is okay. Rook, I should have just taken. Takes, takes. Then knight d5. Takes, takes. Knight e7. Hey, knight b5. <laughs> yes. Provoke weaknesses. Not the best move. Takes here. Because of this, I have this check, check, and takes. And then this, I, I got to see this because I go here, here, here. Bishop here is okay. I wanted my bishop to be active. I go here. I guess I had rook e8. Hilarious. I didn't even see that. Rook e8 here. Um, and then rook a8. Not something I saw easily. Okay. Um... Oh, my, my move was c3 here. I was thinking of stuff like this. And then I guess I can just come back here and guard. But this is a missed opportunity. Place here, here. I see six. Um, yeah, this is right. This is correct. Hold on one second. Boom. Whoops. Here. The best move is actually... What? Oh, just bishop. No, look, look at this. Okay, this is this is frustrating me. This is absolutely frustrating me. Um, Sockfish right now is saying second best move with and it's actually the best move. The best move is rook takes c6, <laughs> rook takes c6, and bishop takes uh d5. They're like Sockfish is going back, but then then it gives me a uh gives me an, an inaccuracy. That's not an inaccuracy, that's a double x clam. Come on, you gotta be kidding me. That's an awesome move right here. Okay, so like literally. Um, Stockfish is is waffling between my move, rook takes uh, knight, and bishop takes pawn. Uh, still, bishop takes d5 is probably a little bit better. But um, but anyway, this is my idea. Takes, 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 boom, boom. And I have six pawns to three. These guys are falling. This is just completely game over. Okay, honestly, I'm very disappointed that rook takes c6 is not a double x clamp. But the cool thing about chess.com is they let me do whatever I want to do, and that is put a double x clamp on this move. So, um, hey, it was fun. I uh, I liked this game. I uh, hope you did too. Um, kind of a fun one. A little bit of a maneuvering going on in the middle game, and uh, if it was if it was somewhat instructional or helpful in any way let me know in the comments if you haven't already subscribed please do so i uh, definitely appreciate that so hey we'll talk to you later thank you for uh watching and it is good to be back for dad life chess we'll talk to you later bye